Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emily and I do handbag unboxings, reviews, comparisons, you name it. I also love fashion and traveling, so you'll see those sprinkles into my channel. If you're interested in any or all of those things, definitely consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell so that you'll be notified of my upcoming videos. I am here today to do an unboxing, actually a double unboxing as you can see from the title. I'm very excited. These were both purchased during the Black Friday slash Cyber Monday stretch and um, many of you might have already seen that there was a lot of good deals going on. So these are two of the things that I got and I'm very excited to share with you. They are true unboxings. So one is from my favorite Zenrev and the other one is new to me. I don't have anything in this brand and that is from Strathberry. So I'll unbox both of them with you and then I guess share with you what it looks like and what I like about it and whatnot. So let's get, let's dig in. I'm opening the Strathberry one first. No particular order just because that's the one that I had last. All right, so this is what it looks like on the inside. It comes in a very beautiful box. Let me just take that out. I'm so glad it came intact. A lot of my pa packages have been very broken or smashed just from, I don't know, the, I don't know why, but I guess sometimes they get thrown around in the truck, I don't know. But this one looks perfect. It comes in this box. It's, it's very sleek. Yeah, I really like it. Look at this. Like I said, this is my first time purchasing from Strathberry. I've actually been wanting to get this two years ago, but I never made the jump. I don't know why. It just has a little thank you card. It says thank you, and it says that in Chinese as well. And then it says the care. Uh, we want you to enjoy, avoid water, oils, perfumes, cosmetics, prolong or exposure to light and heat. If it does get wet, remove excess moisture by dabbing lightly with a soft cloth. And then to contact them. Oh, yes, to, it says to store this product in its original dust bag and box. So that's different. Some people have said to never store your items in a box because you want it to breathe, but this one actually says to do that. So. And then here's the sticker. I'm excited. I never want to rip these stickers, but I think it also never ends up working out if I don't. Okay, let's see. Almost. That's right. <laughs> and here we are. It's very tiny. Looks like that. It's very like a felt dust bag with Strathberry written in gold. Any guesses? I've never really talked about this bag on my channel. So I don't think it'll be very easy to guess. Okay, it comes in another duster bag. To reveal the Nano Tote in the bi color. This is in the purple and light blue color. Let me just take off some of this wrapping. So here it is. It has the iconic bar that Strathberry is known for. And then it has a little tiny handle like right here. It says Strathberry very small right there. And then nothing else on the outside. So this bar does come attached to these two little, I don't know what they're called, the metal bits and they have Strathberry on them. But I think it's gonna be pretty hard for my camera to pick up. But you open it like this, you unlock it, and there is a magnetic uh, closure, as you can hear. Very, very stiff, but not difficult to get into. And on the inside, there is the chain. The chain comes in a gold hardware as well, and it has this blue leather, which matches the handle as well as the other sides. Now, they do sell a lot of different colors, one being the the all one color. They have some that are tri-color. This happens to be the bi-colored one. So that's why the strap, the chain, um, and the handle parts are the blue, and then the rest is the 
purple, which actually looks burgundy to me. And I forgot to say that there are four feet at the bottom, which I love. So I love when bags have feet in them. So they last a lot longer, um, at least in terms of durability for the bottom. On the inside, it has this light color, sort of microfiber feeling material. And then it has Strathberry made in Spain, as well as I think a serial code there. And then there is a slip pocket right there that I think will be good for like cards and cash, but I don't think it will fit my phone. But just for record, I have the Pixel 2 and I just want to show you that it slides right in there very easily. So you can carry it like that um, or not lock it. I am a little bit nervous about locking it very often because then you have to like push the handle down and then pull this over and when you hold it like this I feel like there's strain placed on here and this is one of the reasons why two years ago I did not go for this bag because I was afraid of issues but I know a lot of people have purchased it I know a lot of people have continued to use it and haven't reported these issues so that's why I finally made the jump also because I like mini bags and they finally came out with a nano version I just wanted to show you what the chain looks like. It has these, these clasps at the ends. And so they easily pop in to either side of this bag. There is one right here, this little D-ring. So you can just... So this chain is not adjustable, but it is removable. So if it, if it is too short or too long, you could potentially bring in your own chain. So here we are. I have attached it right here. As you can see, the profile, even though I've attached it, isn't very, it doesn't open the bag up, as you can see. Okay, and then here it is, pushing this back, the bar back over so that it locks it up. So this is the final look of the bag with the chain. So this bag retails for about $500, and I got it on sale for about $300, and it was shipped to me free shipping. Uh, I believe no tax either, so no duty, so it was a pretty good deal to get it from, this was this from Strathberry themselves, but I know they also sell this at Saks um, in the US, so if you are interested in it and you want to see it in person, you, that's where you might want to go and do it. I think Strathberry's store does offer returns even though it's international, but it does help to have a physical store to go into if that's what you're interested in seeing it first. I have seen this in person, which is why I was more in okay about getting it online without trying it on because I've tried other styles, other colors and everything. So I kind of already knew which one fits me and what is my style. So this is the first item that I'm gonna unbox. Let's go on to the second item. Um, again, I purchased it during Black Friday. There's a lot of stuff, good stuff this Black Friday. Actually, I'm wearing some of it right now. This top is from Black Friday, it's so soft, so stretchy. It's part, I think, part cashmere. I'll link it below. Oh, this one's also from Black Friday. This is my new jewelry from Misoma. I've never had anything from Misoma before and I really like it. And yeah, it's just this opal on a gold chain with beads on it. This one is from Intimacy Me, and yeah. Oh, this one is not new, but this one is from Monica Vinader. So if you're interested in any of those things, I'll also link it down below. Actually, you know what? I might do a gift, a last minute gift guide as my next video. So if you're interested, definitely stay tuned. I know there's still some gifts to be purchased, so I'll try to throw out as many ideas of things that I like out there for you if, if that will help. So let's move on to our second unboxing from Senrev. Now Senrev did do a lot of good Black Friday and Cyber Monday sales. I tried to include that in my Instagram because I wasn't able to make a video for Cyber Monday. One of my uh, previous videos, I did mention the Black Friday deal, so I hope you took advantage of that. If you have not, I highly recommend you uh, following me on my Instagram at clutch to carry all so that you could see my more quickly updated news. Okay. Their packaging is always very sturdy. So if you have not seen an unboxing, it looks like this. On the inside, Senrev's wrapping paper is with the octopus and also with Senrev. And there's just a note from the founders about, uh, was founded by, to empower women like you. Um, we'd love to hear your thoughts, feedback, feedback and ideas so that's pretty and it also has an embossed sun rev i don't even think you can see because it it's just embossed in there my receipt and 
here is the item another very small one that's it <laughs> i always i always forget to check so sometimes i forget something in there so here is the item tied up Ooh. I'm so excited about this one, guys. Here we are. This is their red carpet bracelet pouch in the snakeskin. Oh, it's heavy because I think, yeah, because this bar, I don't know if you can hear, it's a gold bar. So usually this clutch is called their bracelet pouch and it is a t it could be attached to their crossbody bag and the the part right here could be removed to wear as a bracelet because it's leather that matches the bag but because this one is a special edition it's it's something that that one of the founders wore to the red carpet and so it is made of gold and you cannot remove it there's also no button clasp to attach to any of the bags but it looks really pretty it, it feels really weighted it doesn't smell like too much of anything, but <laughs> that's fine. There is a zipper pull up here. And on the inside, there is the tag that usually comes with it. And that's their signature blue microfiber with a slip pocket of a material that matches the outside of the bag. And it says Senrev on the other side. And let me just see. So Senrev made in Italy, there's a tag there. Remember that's the bar, look how shiny that is. And so what you do is you slip your hand in here and then you hold it, like, it's a little stiff, I think. <laughs> so you hold it like this, or if you don't like it, you could just hold it like that. <laughs> I have the Pixel 2 again, <laughs> and it fits very easily into this bag, so. Definitely can fit a lot. I, I noticed like right off the bat that because this thing is metal and it's stiff, when you open it, it doesn't open very easily. And the reason is because this this side cannot open, it cannot dome out. You see how this side can like bend out? This side can't, it's like stiff. So it, it does make putting something in there a little bit more difficult, but the I think the size of this clutch is the same as other clutches. If you did take advantage of their Black Friday sales, you'll notice that they did have some of these as a free gift with purchases. I actually went for, I think the new card holder, uh, the flat card case, I guess. They called it the cart folio, I believe. That one is gonna come separately and I, cause I don't see it here. I think it's gonna be, get shipped separately. That one was what I got for free, but some of the, some of you might have seen that these ones were also gift with purchases. If you got one, it will look like this, except with a leather piece. I'm very excited about this one. I don't have anything that looks like this animal snake skin print before, so I, I'm very excited to add it to my collection. It'll be great for the holidays coming up, the events and everything, and it's like low-key, you know, well with the bar, but you can always turn it around and it'll become a little low-key. This can go with a lot of outfits because it's a neutral color, but it's a sort of like a special neutral color. As you can see, it's not just like your typical neutral. So yeah, I'm very excited to have this in my collection and very excited to finally have a Strathberry as well in my collection. So if you are interested in either of these two things or any of the things that I'm wearing here today, I will link it below. If you have any questions about them, leave them in the comments and I'll try to get back to them. Again, I'll try to do a last minute gift guide on my next video so that you can see all the goodies I got. Um, I don't think a lot of these are on sale anymore, but if they are, I'll certainly link it below as well. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.